Today I will show how to use Tiger Thighs Japanese ready to use shrimp tempura to make instant shrimp tempura in two ways. In the first video I will show how I commonly make it that is I fry it. In the second video I will follow the instructions on the packet and to make it in the oven. I'm Renita. Welcome to my channel. This tiger thighs ready to use shrimp tempura has two sizes. I have taken the larger size. It has 20 large shrimps packed in four packets along with four soya sauce packets. So one packet has five shrimps, one soya sauce for each packet. These tempuras can be fried, baked in oven, grilled or air fried. In this video, I will show only two options, frying and baking. Since the packet is always stored in the freezer or deep fridge, it is always frozen. I generally don't defrost before frying. I open the packet and leave the shrimps and soya sauce open to defrost till I heat the oil. In the deep frying korai, I heated sunflower oil enough for deep frying till steaming hot. Since I have a small frying korai, I have put two shrimp tempuras. I fried them till light brown in medium heat, otherwise shrimp inside will be undercooked. Flip few types. As soon as they are slightly brown, I, I pick them out of the oil and place them in a strainer to drain excess oil. After 5 to 6 minutes of straining, this much oil has come out. It has cooled down a bit as well, so it's ready to be served with soy sauce. This is how it looks. It is very very crunchy, crispy and yummy. The shrimp is also well cooked inside. For the second process, I will follow the instructions given at the back of the packet. However, I will make little adjustments as per the need to complete the job. I have preheated my electric oven at 400 degree Fahrenheit for 20 minutes. In the meantime, I had placed the temperas on a non-stick baking tray and let it defrost for 20 minutes while the oven preheated. If the tray is not non-stick, then please spray some oil or use a parchment paper or butter paper. I place the tray at the center of the middle rack. I microwaved at 400 degree Fahrenheit at regular baking mode for 10 minutes. Instruction said 8 to 10 minutes each side as per my oven and the time spent in defrosting my one side cooking time is 10 minutes. I flipped them and baked at the same temperature for another 10 minutes. After a total of 20 minutes of baking, the temperatures are ready. I left the tray outside to let the temperatures cool down. I have separate videos on them in Bangla in shorts. You can check them out. Please make them at home and write in the comment box how it was and which process you followed. If you like the video, then please subscribe, like, comment and share. Also click the bell icon. I will be back with another delicious video. Bye.